Boots Bowl Pitches Tier List Maker by Pack Jack. Shout out Pack Jack. Join the Discord. Send it through Discord. Yeah, 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 yeah. If you have tier lists, send it to the Discord. Anywho, so we have the Knuckle Drop. We have a slider. We have a rising slider. We have a riser. Two seam, screwball, sinker, curve, splitter, changeup. Is there any other pitches, chat? Is there any other possible pitches that I'm missing? I guess you could throw in Knuckle Curve and a couple others, but man, L AirPods. Anywho, I think we'll just work with this list right here. That's a pretty good list. It covers pretty much all the uh, basic pitches, all the uh, necessities, if you will. So we're going to start off with the most basic and work our way to, I'd say, the more complicated slash niche pitches, like only a few guys know. First of all, the riser. Mid. Mid AF. Unless you are named Sammy Reezer. If you're not named Sammy Reezer, it is mid. Everybody can hit a straight ball. The whole point of blitz ball is to not throw it straight and to make it curve twice the distance of a baseball. So, we're going to put riser in the mid category. It's not bad. It's not great. I guess mine just sucks. All right. Next, we'll go with the two-seam here. This is going to be a little bit tough because the two-seam some days is, is gross. It's probably one of the best pitches, honestly, because you can get that thing to move like this far, like this much. Oh, yeah, I guess we did forget Jack Bresnan. Yeah, that's probably one of the best risers in the game. I'm still leaving it at B. Chat, how do we feel about that? I think B is solid for a riser. I think that's fair. I think that's 100% fair. I think that is 100% fair, unless I'm missing something here. But I think I'm on it. I think I'm on it. First pick so far, pretty base, pretty base. Next pitch, two seam. Like I said earlier, it depends on the day. If it's like super windy, the two seam can be the best pitch in all of Blitz Ball because you're not going to hit it. It's just going to move too much. It also could be the worst pitch because it's just like, if you're a righty throwing it to other righties, if you're sitting on it outside, it's always going to come back into the zone. So you can barrel it up pretty easily. So I'm going to actually throw it under the riser at C tier because it's not a pitch you want to be throwing all the time, but it is a good pitch if, you're, if you can paint corners with it, one, and two, if you can get it to move a lot or do something else with it, like either sink or rise. So I'm going to put it C just for general public. We're going to go as an overall, like if any random Joe Schmo picked up a blitz ball and started throwing these pitches. So we're going to go C tier with a 2C. It might be a crazy list. I don't know. It's the best pitch if you know how to throw it, but... Nobody cares to throw it except me, Sammy, or Joe. That's, that's what I'm saying. It's kind of a niche pitch. Like, you have to be, like, one of the upper echelon guys who throws it. Same thing with a two-seam. I would say my two-seam is one of the best. Who, I, I don't even know who has, like, a really good two-seam. But that's what I'm saying. That makes it not a good pitch. If only, like, me, Adam's got a really good two-seam. Andrew's got a good two-seam. Andrew's gets crushed, though, so it doesn't really count. Yeah, two seam C. It's gotta be C. Let's rearrange these real quick. Let's rearrange these. So we're just gonna go change up real quick. That's self-explanatory. You really don't need to explain that. Who throws a change up? Nobody. There's a reason no one throws it. Now, this one's a little bit tough. We're gonna go sinker next. The sinker. I think there's only really one person in Blitzball who throws it effectively and like throws an actual sinker. Um, Adams is more of a splitter. It's got to be Tyler, bro. Tyler's the only one who throws, like, an actual sinker. I've been trying to throw a sinker, but it doesn't it doesn't do the same thing as, like, a baseball would. Like, you can't throw it hard. Like, Tyler's really the only guy to throw it. So, unless you are unless you are Tyler Davis, I'm just going to have to go D just for the sake of no one throws it but him. And no one throws it good if they do have it. So, going to have to put sinker in the D. So that might ruffle some feathers, but you know what? It is what it is. Now, let's get into the interesting stuff. Knuckle drop. Best knuckle drops... Notable ones, you got Chandler's, the OG Chandler, you know, before Grandpa hurt his shoulder. You got Tyler, obviously. Tyler's knuckle drop is the best in the game. I'd say I throw a pretty good knuckle drop from time to time. Take a gander in the knuckle drop game. Only against Caden, though. I only throw good ones against Caden, but whatever. I'm going to have to go... Since that is a, I'm going to have to go S tier. I'm going to have to go S tier. And my reasoning being that there's actually a decent amount of guys who throw this, and they throw it well. So we're gonna go. We're gonna go S tier. It's a pretty solid pitch. You're pretty much no one hits it. I don't think I've ever seen a home run hit off a knuckle drop. So it's got to be S tier for sure. Splitter. Now this one's also another pretty niche pitch. I only know one guy who throws this pitch, and his name is Adam Knutson. And there's a reason he's ranked number one in the world. So I'm gonna have to go C tier. It is a pretty simple pitch to throw though, but it's super hard to uh, get a hold of it. Knuckle drop is at max a B. All right, I'm gonna need I'm gonna need some explaining there. That is a crazy take. Mid tier knuckleball or knuckle drop is crazy, bro. Cause no one hits it. Name one homer that was off a knuckle drop. I'll sit here and wait. Honestly, we'll just 
I need a Jeopardy sound. I need a Jeopardy sound. I'll wait. Anywho, until we can explain why it's B tier. Alright, I rest my case. I rest my case. That's blue fall debate. All, all I have to do is play Jeopardy music. So therefore, Knuckle Drop is an automatic A or an S. Anywho, next pitch, the slider. Now this one gets a lot of hate. This pitch gets a lot of hate. But I will say it is the number one off speed that people use. It's also the number one pitch that gets like demolished. If you're gonna crush a pitch, it's either a slider or a riser. It is what it is. It is what it is. But if you also throw it really well, Tyler Slider is lights out. Kespel has a lights out slider. I have probably the best slider in the game. It's also unstoppable because especially a righty righty matchup, it moves behind righties and then comes back in. Like your brain just can't even like function. How do you hit a ball that's coming from behind you? You can't, you can't. I'm gonna have to go slider A. I'm gonna have to go slider A. Slider C tier is crazy. What is a good pitch then? I mean, this is also, this is also chat. This is also the guy who only throws a riser. So I would assume that riser would be S tier and then everything else is B or lower. Oh my god. But no, seriously though, seriously though. I think slider is a pretty easy A tier if you know how to throw it. Like, we gotta think, this is for all pitchers, bro. This is a general just rate the pitches. Like, if I had these pitches on the table, not assuming who's throwing them or who's in the box, you just gotta put them up there. You just gotta put them up and put them somewhere on the list. So, I'm putting slider A. I think that's a pretty lock. I think that's a pretty good lock. Chat, I think that's a lock. Yeah, we're gonna save the best one for last, obviously. Screwball! Screwball. Oh man. You'll stop dissing the knuckleball and the knuckle drop and slider? Oh, I'm not dissing the riser. I said it was mid. I said it's like the definition of middle tier. The riser is literally like the first pitch you learn how to throw is a straight fastball. It's the same thing in baseball. Like before you even know grips on a ball, the first thing you're throwing is a fastball. The first thing they teach you is to hold a four-seam fastball while you're in the field and throw it as a four-seam so the ball doesn't move, it doesn't drop off, you get the most amount of straight spin. Like, bro, screwball S, okay, 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 before I get my take, screwball S is a little bit crazy, but I'm just saying, bro, riser is definition of mid-tier, bro, and like I said, unless you were the upper echelon guys who do something a little bit different and their riser is top tier, that's the only exception that the riser would get bumped up, and even then, I don't think it gets bumped up. So, I'm going to make my move, and then I'm going to explain why, because I know this is definitely going to ruffle some feathers. I want to I see the chat go crazy for a little bit. I want to see the chat go crazy with that one. Because I'm going to be able to justify this point perfectly. I'm going to articulate it to a T. 10 out of 10 articulation. But I know chat's going to get a little bit mad with that. We're going to screw ball A. Screw ball is an easy A. It's a lock. It is a lock at A. That's, okay, okay, we're on the same page here, so... Just for reference, Gainesville Blitzball League, probably the most reliable pitch ever. Brilliant take. That's exactly where I was going with that. It is literally fastball grip. You throw it sidearm. You're going to get four times the movement you could with a good riser. And then on top of that, it's also very easy to locate. The only downside to it, though, is if it's not moving a lot or you're not able to throw it near that 80 mile an hour speed limit, it gets crushed, bro. Especially to righties. If you're a righty on righty matchup, bro, you're probably getting, it's probably getting crushed. But... Universally, this is one of the best pitches that anybody can throw and anybody can throw really well. And also just get automatic strikes, bro. Like, you're not going to expect someone to crush it. Now, with a slider, if you throw it middle-middle, especially in a hitter's count, bro, it's probably going to get crushed. With a screwball, though, you never know. You could probably throw some gem screwball, especially at the top of the zone. That's a really hard pitch to hit, even if you're behind in the count. So, I got to go screwball A because of the reliability factor. It's also just a really fun pitch to throw, I'm not going to lie. Ban transform. This list is so bad, bro. You need to get on Discord right now, and you need to give me your list, bro. I know your list is probably a two out of ten, bro. Now, curveball. I move slider to be in this list has hope, bro. You're you're. <laughs> bro, that's crazy, bro. Slider to be is crazy. Also, my soundboard got mixed up on me. Curveball C is absolutely crazy. Actually, no. That's a really good take. That's a really good take. I had to think about it for a second. I don't know anybody who throws a straight-up 12-6 curveball or even a slurve. 
Nobody. I think Reese might have a really gross slurve, but even then, he throws it over 80. The only person who throws, like, a genuine, like, 12-6 curveball is me. So, just by that fact alone, you gotta put it C. That's fair. That's fair. And even though it's probably my best pitch of all time, like, it's the easiest pitch to get clips and go viral, no clickbait, I literally freaking am the only one who throws it. Self-glaze is crazy. How is that a self-glaze if I literally threw curve at C tier because I'm the only one who throws it? All right, whatever. Chat's a bunch of haters. You guys are a bunch of haters in chat. Now, finally, now it's time for some real self-glazing. W list, W chat. What do you guys think of the reaction? You know, comment down below. What do we think about this list? What do we think about this list, chat? I think it's all. I think we got a banger. I think we got a banger list. Self-glazing list. How is this a self-glazing list? Chat. How the hell is this a self-glazing list? There's been absolutely zero glazing. This is Krispy Kreme with only cake donuts, bro. No glazing, only icing. It's the good stuff, bro. Cherries on top and everything. You guys are tweaking if you don't agree with this list. I'm sorry, you're tweaking. I would like to see Andrew put together a list. Get on Discord right now, you bum. Get on Discord right now. You know what? I'm going to send you a Discord call. L. Andrew. Yeah, W. L. Andrews, bro. L. Andrews. Who else just heard Musty Trip Park? That's my chair, Goofball. Listen. That's my chair, Goofball. Honestly, it's a solid splitter. Is B, though? Oh, my God. Splitter B is just freaking... That's the worst take I've heard yet. Buddy, put together your list. I'm sending you a Discord call. I want to, I want to see your list. I actually want to see your list. All right, you bum. You're on stream. You have been just going crazy with the L chats, bro. You're the king of L you're, you're the L, you're the L chat king. All right, chat. Andrew's gonna go ahead and give us our his list because um it's a fat L. Anyways, so first pitch you have is the riser. Second pitch two seam. Third pitch change up. Fourth pitch slider. Fifth pitch rising slider. Then you have sinker, you, splitter, screwball, knuckle drop curve. First one riser. First one riser. Um, go with the healthy B. Okay, that's fair. That's fair. No need to justify that one. We already explained why. Two yeah. seam. Mmm. If it starts outside, like way out, there aren't many people who can throw it. So it's unique. I'll give it a, an A. Okay. Okay. Two seam in the A spot. Oh, change up. My bad. Change up. Um. <laughs> no one throws it. That's a D. Who throws a D? Yeah, it's an automatic D. That's what I'm saying. <laughs> Slider. Definitely an A. All right, I'm going to have to pause you real quick. The the self-glazing on the riser coming out of Gainesville Blitzball League right now is absolutely atrocious. Stop the cap. Like, bro, it is not an A, dog. Riser is not an S tier. That is crazy. It's not even an A tier. Riser A tier is freaking... It's out there. That's a stretch. Next pitch. <laughs> Rising slider. Right. That's unique, too. That's A. Okay, okay. Then you have the sinker. Like a, that's not super cool. Sinker? Yeah, I'm assuming it's like overhand. C, yeah. Okay, okay. Then you have a splitter. I don't know who throws that either. We'll go with B. I think Adam and Jack are literally the only two. I don't watch blitzball like that, or too much, but. L Andrew for I'm that. Uh, screwball. Oh, I think that's definitely an S. Right? Has to be. Don't, don't ask me. I mean, it's your list, dog. We're going to clown you after you make your list. And then you have the then you have the knuckle drop. S. Okay, and then last pitch, curveball. I don't know who throws a curveball. C. Eh. Yeah. Are you, are you, you're joking right now, right? B. We'll go B. Curveball. You're, you're joking know. right now, right? No one, th you don't know anybody who throws a curveball. I mean, I do. I throw a curveball, bro. I got curveball clips all over YouTube. All right, anyways. L list, L Andrew. That, that was a terrible list. I, I put it in B. I put it in B. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to recreate my list, and we're going to hold them side by side here. Okay, so this is my list right here, chat. My list right here. Read it in wheat. Soak it in. Let that sink in. Let that sink in real quick. And then we're going to slide over to Andrew's list. Pretty similar. Honestly, it's pretty similar. Not bad. It's not a bad list. Even though ours are literally... Almost yeah, identical. yeah, I know. It, it's not bad. It's not bad. You were just you were spitting some L takes in the chat, bro. I had to address it, bro. I had to address it because we do it live. 
Some of the takes were valid. No, they were I not. Didn't say, I didn't say anything about bad pitches. Bro, you just said self-glazing after every time I ranked a pitch. <laughs> How is that not a bad take? Oh, God. Did we get Jack's list right now? Yeah, why not? Okay. Answer your Discord. You you can't beat the allegations. You're not going to beat the allegations, bud. Sorry. Oh, is he ducking allegations here? All right, buddy. Bro, you, you, oh, you, bad. you're not beating the allegations. I'm sorry. You're not beating the allegations. These lists are so horrible, brother. Le I, I already know you're going to go off in some tangent. Let's just get it over with. First pitch, riser. Let's just get right into it. Uh, S. Oh, my Easily, God. Easily, bro. Easily. Easily is crazy. Easily is bro. crazy. Haram. Stop the cap. Guys, That's crazy, bro. 95% Haram. Bro. Bruh. I throw 95% of the time. But that's, you, bro. but that's just you. But that's just you. That's what I'm saying. That's not everybody, bro. That's why I put it B. I look at it as the peak of each pitch. The peak of each pitch. So we are taking the best player who throws this pitch at the max caliber. Okay, okay. I'll put it in A. I'll put it in A. I'll put it in A. How is that a compromise? That is, that is not a compromise. Honest. If we're it being honest, a it's, a, it's a freaking B tier to C tier. <laughs> If we are being honest, but we're not being honest, so we're putting in A. Two-seam. Nobody can do it, bro. Two-seam. Two seam, uh, B. Okay, that's fair. Slider. Two-seam's like an A without the speed limit, though. Easily. But, uh, but slider? We're, we're, going, we're going speed limit. This is based on speed no, limit. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Or else there would be no slider. point for, like, half these pitches. Slider's B. That, slider that is, is one, of the, one of the worst pitches ever. It's so I, flat. Everyone that throws them are it's flat, bro. Bro, it, bro, 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 That's why a curveball is better than a slider. But who throws a curveball? You. And Patrick? that's it. Oh, I guess Patrick. Okay, I'm glazing my own league. I gotta chill. But no, 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 no. What what pitch are we on? Slider. That was a horrible take. Slider. Still slider. We're still on slider. And slider being B is just crazy but i kind of see where you're coming from because it's so cool. the worst the yeah, worst sliders cool. are really bad but the top sliders are really really good therefore it's like two two like extremes so you gotta exactly. like mush them together and it makes them mid tier so i see where you're coming from with that one i still think it's an l but whatever sinker sinker is a c bro it is so bad nobody mm -hmm. okay 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 Fair. hold on it's just when people do throw it it's predictable because the only person that can throw it is tyler and it's just whatever. It's I think Tyler's the only one who can throw it, though. Like, no one else just throws it. It is It is a very general list, though. I will give it that. It's not like a... This isn't. This could go so many different ways because you can add a couple, like, variables to this list and it would actually make it interesting, but it is a very general list. So I will, I will I mean, give you that. Idea? All right. Cur curveball next pitch. Curveball. This is where there's a problem because it's, it's just like slider. It's okay. like if you have a good breaking ball, then you're gonna have a then it's good. But if you but if it's are bad, just picking it's up bad. a blitz ball, then it's gonna be horrible and hangy. Yeah. It's just for the people that can like actually throw it hard that it's good. But I'll put it at B as well. I think curveball and slider are basically the same pitch. Both coming in on a righty. Both horrible. Yeah. I, I think the only the only ball. person who throws it twelve to six is me. So I I agree with that. Everybody yeah, else I is like a slur that just that. hangs. I Absolutely send that 200 feet, my brother. That's a horrible take. I'm not going to lie. <laughs> Bruh. Change up. Uh, change up is D. Nobody Easy. It. Yeah. Horrible. Yeah, that's a little kid pitch. The fact that you even included it in this list actually uh, made it kind of funny. Rising slider. Here, I'll just put it on there for you, and then you can just justify it. Yeah, it's S. <laughs> because. because W take. That's the one good take of the day. Because everyone that throws it never gets hit. And if it does get hit, it's straight into the ground. Well, I will say the only, I think the only one I've seen get hit is I've given up two hits with it. No, one hit. Mm -hmm. Chandler, Chandler hit a freaking piss missile with it. And then I have hit one of Sammy's, but mm -hmm. it does vary player to player. Like it, you don't see it unless you're at that like top tier oh, of pitching. So it's put in A. It's back in A. All right, that's fair. Yeah. I only threw it in S because I made it. Good pitch. It is a very good pitch, but it does take a while to like actually master it because Adam tried it. Adam tried throwing it and his didn't slide. 
It was just a straight up riser. So you do have to one. There's two elements to it. One, you have to have swing to actually get the ball to move horizontally, and then two, you have to have such a good spin rate that it'll spin like straight up and down and get vertical movement as well. So it, it is like a very multifaceted pitch. If you can get that late break on it, it is the best pitch. In oh the yeah, because makes the it makes the coolest cool. clips too. Oh my god. Yeah, it makes some cool clips. I do love rising slider clips. Screwball. S. I'm not gonna argue with that. I'm not gonna argue with it. It is. Such I think, a I think that's fair. Pitch. And my my screwball is literally so shit, and I still throw it because I know people just don't hit it. It's fair. Because why not? Yeah, it's such. It's a fair. Pitch. It's a, it's just reliable all around, so you kind of have to bump yeah. it up just based on that. Mm -hmm. All right, splitter. What did I say in chat? Splitter. Honestly, it's solid. Splitter is B, though. You can't just throw it like me and Adam. Mad because bad. <laughs> Quoted. Quote of the day. W -S Again, I think it fits into the slider curveball category where, well, kind of. I I'll put it at B. I do agree that it's B because if you can actually throw it like mid-70s, that pitch is impossible to hit. It is such I mean, a different look. It is such a different look. I throw it more like a like a hard breaking pitch adam throws it more like a changeup. it's a little it's different so okay that's fair you can, you can bury it because I, I know adam definitely uses it as a changeup, and it's good most of the time for like people who struggle with timing up but for those top tier hitters who like timing is irrelevant too so like sammy obviously like it doesn't matter his timing you're still gonna put adam on the ball i think splitter is just an irrelevant pitch like if you throw it at him he's just gonna be ready for it and even if he's early on it he's still gonna catch barrel like it's a very it's a barrel finder Basically, and I don't mean that as like a derpy little insult, but it's just what it comes out to be. Because that's why changeups are just so irrelevant. Like speed changing pitches are so irrelevant unless they have movement with them, or or if you're just throwing it to like people who can't time time up balls. I guess. I think it's kind of I think it's hard to grade the splitter too, just because nobody really throws it, and we've never seen like really the peak of what that pitch can do. Very true. It is a very new pitch. It is a very very new yeah. pitch. I will say there is a couple pitches that aren't included on this list. Like, I just invented a new pitch that I, I, I can't name it, bro. Like, I literally don't have a name for it. It is a sidearm knuckle slider. It is, that's literally the best way to describe it. It is a sidearm knuckle slider. Last pitch, knuckle drop. Um, Probably A, because it's, it's better than a curveball and slider, but it, it, it has a leg up on it. But it's not as good as a screwball because just it's it's too unreliable control wise. If you pick up a blitz ball, and you're throwing a knuckle drop, it's it's super unreliable control wise. So that's why I can't be S. That's fair. Because I 100 percent agree. Screwball gets the job done, and you can control it. Knuckle drop gets the job done, but it's harder to control. So it's I will say though, on an 0-2 count, I would much rather throw a knuckle drop because not only is it unpredictable in the pitcher's hands to a certain extent, it is super unpredictable to the batter's eyes. Especially if it's like starting super high, it can always catch the top of the zone. Like it, yeah. if you throw a perfect knuckle drop, which is so hard, way harder to do than a perfect screwball. But let's just say you're throwing a perfect knuckle drop five out of ten times, and it's like O2 counts where you have six balls to work with. I would much rather go with a knuckle drop. And if you can paint it on the top part of the zone or even on corners, it's not getting hit, and you know it's not getting hit. But that's fair. That's fair. That's a pretty solid list. Now that I'm looking at it, I, I agree with the list. I see where you're coming from. Yours, your list is built more of like a reliability and overall counting the zone aspect. That's all I do, bro. We have Jack Bresnahan's list right here. Screwball at S. Riser, rising slider, knuckle drop A. Two seam slider, curve, and splitter at the B tier. Sinker at the C tier, and change up at the D tier. I, it's a pretty good list. Now we have, I think this is L. Andrews. No, this is my list. Let's go ahead and move it to the front because I made it first. My list right here, we got knuckle drop and rising slider at the S tier. A tier, we got slider screwball. B tier is the riser. C tier, two seam splitter curve. And D tier, we have the changeup and sinker. And last and always last, L. Andrews list, which is the screwball and knuckle drop at the S spot. A spot, we have a two seam slider, rising slider. B tier, we have riser, splitter, and curve. And C tier, we have the sinker as long and as well as the changeup in the D tier. So let me know. Let me know in the comments, guys, if you're agreeing with these lists and what other tier lists should we be doing in the future? I definitely want to get more tier lists. I definitely want to get more reaction content on the channel for you guys. And, uh, yeah. I think that was pretty solid. I think that's pretty solid. You know solid. Nowadays, my niggas pushing Bintiaga, yeah, the trust. If you boys really want drama, I'ma tell they ass pull up.
I sat down on it. 